Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here, welcoming you to episode 22 of Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn. And we're going to continue with these last few minigames that we got to do here. I'm pretty sure there's only one carry stage to do, but I don't know, those last two, like, I unlocked a new one after completing one. So, you never know. Yeah, so hopefully we'll actually get the boss of the water world in this video. Because I want to move on to the next world, because that's, that's going to be fun. I think the next one is the snow world. And I really like that. I don't know, the fact that I really like that might be pro propagating the Canadian stereotype, but... I don't know, man. Alright, how am I gonna go about this? Now, well, how am I gonna go about it? I'm gonna go left, in the, or right, in the level. That's how I'm gonna go about it. Alright, I think I'm better off just waiting here instead of trying to drop carry and do whatever. Alright. Um, jeez. This is gonna be a little tricky, it looks like. Alright, well, that's not too bad. Alright, crap. But now I've gotta get myself up there. Is that gonna be the biggest challenge of this whole video? Getting myself up here? Oh, no, it doesn't look like it. At least they gave you optimal time to do this. Though I don't know how far away the throne is. Dude, get off that thing and pick up carry. Jeez, man. Alright, so she's gonna drop down there. I don't know if she's safe or not down there, but... Let's just pray that she is. Oh, I saw the throne up there, so that's where we have to get her up to. And it's gonna be a pain in the ass to do that, I'm sure. Yeah, you know what I'm gonna have to do? I'm gonna have to... Dr this is gonna be so weird. I'm gonna have to time this perfectly if I want to do this right. I'm gonna have to drop carry. Uh, no, get off the umbrella, dude! Oh, crap. Oh, shit. How are you supposed to do that? You have to, like, put her down. Maybe I can just... Oh, what? What? The umbrella was still up? That's crazy, man. Shouldn't have been still up. Alright, well, maybe I'll have enough time to do it if the umbrella stays open for that long. Alright, here, here we go. Oh, now just get up the ladder. Sweet. Is that, like, the first carry stage I've done in one try? It feels like it. I don't know. Hmm. It's stuff. Damn it! Damn it! It's all the same! Ah! Oh. Jeez, all of these assholes want me to do two for one. We got a two for one sale here in Quilty Square. What is that fabric? It looks very spacey. It's Palm Island fabric. It looks like star a starry sky, though. Oh, jeez. Well, I guess we better do this. Oh, the secret island. This is gonna be great. Is this the stage that I was thinking of before where they like confine you to that one area with the moths flying everywhere? Uh, get here to this spot in a minute 30. Yeah, it looks like it's the pl place with the moths too. Yeah, I remember this minigame vividly, which might be which could be a good or a bad thing. All right. Oh what? How am I supposed to okay. So I've got since I can't carry carry through a door, I gotta throw her up there and it's gonna be really tedious already, I can tell. Wait a second, how, how do I get up there now? What? Oh, oh, duh, the platform's here. Jeez, the platform's fooled me. What can I say? Alright, man, they don't give me much time for this at all, do they? I have to get to, like, the top of this place by the end of this crap. Oh, wait, no, I can't even go up from here, damn it. So I gotta get on this platform that's going up and down here. Well, isn't that just dandy? Oh my god. Okay, so I gotta do this. That's how it's gonna work. So it's basically a relay. This is how is how this carry stage is gonna work. That's how it seems, anyways. Oh, it looks like we made it, though. That was not as hard as I thought. I thought I had to go a lot higher than that, actually, so... I'm gladly surprised by that. Very, very glad. I'm very glad, bad. I'm so glad, Dad. <laughs> oh, I said that one time as a kid. I don't even know what the situation was that I was saying that in. But I thought I was so cool because I was making a rhyme. I'm it's like going like, I'm so glad, Dad. <laughs> and win. Jeez, I need to find a practical use for that and win situation. For that catchphrase, I mean. Because I just can't think of anything. 
Past Diddy Kong Racing is, I don't know, is that Catchway is doomed to die now? Oh, but it seems like such a good one, just the way I fluctuate my voice, go like, and win. It starts off really crisp at the very beginning with the and, and then it goes all smooth and silky when I go, win. Oh, of course, here I go compl complimenting my own catchphrases. Got an ego on this one, all right, Kapamari. I honestly don't remember this boss fight too well, so this could be a total massacre if I t if I screw myself. I don't, I don't know. Maybe I'll remember once I see it. I wonder why he's called Kapamari, though. Maybe he's going to bust a cap in your ass. Oh, no. Whoa! <laughs> Dude, he's wearing a nightcap. Oh, my God. I kind of remember this one now just because of that nightcap. Whoa, uh, get your tentacles away. Oh, sweet, sweet. What am I doing? What am I? What? Oh, oh jeez, this is crazy. Ah, oh, these tentacles. Oh my god, what What the hell? I don't even know what I'm doing, really. Oh god, okay, so do I throw this at him now? Um, uh, that's, my, that's my, yes, okay, sweet. That's what I had to do. Not bad. Alright, can I like whip these tentacles? I can, sweet. That is good stuff. Alright, be sure to pick up all the beads now. Don't skimp out on anything. Jeez, it seems like a very relaxed boss battle. Kind of like uh, that one guy on... in freaking Aquas. I don't know. Lots of boss battles underwater seem to be just so relaxed just because water slows everything down. And water music is generally very calming. I don't know, this music isn't too calming. There's like serene parts to this music though. Oh my god, look! Oh! I'm, you made me drop like five stars there, dude. Thankfully, got them all back, but still. Stay away! Stay away! Dude, crap! Uh, I've almost got his nightcap all the way off, though, so this is turning out well. Oh, jeez! He's uncovering something! Oh, man! Oh, my god! Oh, this is crazy! He's, he's pissed off now! Oh, this is phase two of the boss battle now. Whoa! What? Oh my god. Oh crap. Oh, I see. I see. So you have to watch for his eyes and watch when they appear. Oh. Man, I'm scared now. This is a bit scary. Alright. Ooh, pick one of these up. Pick pick it up. Alright. Because I know I'm, I'm going to have to throw, throw one of these at that guy. I'm pretty sure, anyways. Boom! Yeah! You don't like that very much, do you? I should think not. I should hope not. Alright, we're up to silver here. Why is he blowing out beads now? Oh, okay. Is it to lure me? To lure me towards the center so I get hit with those damn things? Well, it didn't work that time. It worked. You fooled me once. Shame on me. Fo or something. I don't know. <laughs> Completely forget how that catchphrase goes. Or how that figure of speech goes. Oh, no. No, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Sweet. Oh, that's not as hard to avoid as I, you might think. Huh. Alright, grab one of you. Oh, crap. Here we go. Yeah, buddy! I'm getting the hang of this now. I'm getting the hang of it. Right, and here he is. Boom! Oh, yeah. Oh, right, wait, grab him! I didn't realize there was a button on his face. Jeez. There's a button on his face. And there's a coat in the closet. Alright, well, I've got all my beads that I need, so now it's just a matter of keeping the beads until the very end. I See, I even have, like, way beyond the beads I need for the patch. That's crazy. You never get this many beads in a boss battle. If anything, you just barely get the amount of beads that you need. Alright. We're doing good, we're doing good. Of course, I guess just like any boss battle, once you get the pattern down, it's not that hard. Yeah, even that's not that hard. Like, there's so many, like, little drills across the screen, you think it would be a lot harder than it actually is to avoid them all. Alright. Oh, he's dead! Yay! Lol. Yeah, I guess they realized I was getting the boss pattern down finally. And then they're just like, okay, now that he's got it down, let's just end the battle. Sweet. It's like a test of my strategy. Test your might. Cool. Streak of 73. 
Alright, you found Kapamari music. And a treasure map patch. Sweet. Now we're gonna get this really corny scene again. Uh, I could skip it, of course, but... We got the magic yarn. We got the magic, the magic yarn. And the magic spaghetti. And high into the sky. Oh, so let's string the two worlds together. Jesus, like imperialism. Oh, it is the snow world. That makes me happy. Yay. The yarn weaved its way into the Look at those evergreens and the giant snowman like that thing from Banjo-Kazooie. Alright. What? Oh my god. Back in Dreamland. The yarn D's are taking over. Chaos. What is going on here? It appeared that Yin Yarn's Waddle Dee imposters had captured all of the real Waddle Dees. No, dude. You can't be mean to my Waddle Dees. Only I can be mean to my Waddle Dees. <laughs> oh, oh, so that's your kind of relationship with them. Troops decided to show King DDD who oh, crap. Hey, Tickle th fight! Th Okay, that hurts. Okay, that hurts. <laughs> and in no time, they had King DDD wrapped up like a birthday present. Jeez, I don't know if I should be talking over this or not. <laughs> Only one more step and Dreamland will be mine. What an honor to have a king serving me. Oh. Yin Yarn sock began to glow. And sucked King DDD right Oh, crap. Now King DDD's in Patchland, too. <laughs> that can't Dreamland be good. will be mine. Not sure what I'll do with it, but I'll figure something out. <laughs> Could no one stop Yin Yarn from tearing apart the very fabric of Dreamland? Oh, <laughs> you get that pun there? The very fabric of Dreamland. Oh, that's so bad. That's crazy. Alright, well, my throat is so dry and I'm out of coke, so I think that's going to have to be the sign that this is the end of the video. Uh, we've got Snowland now. Of course. And, well, I guess I'll throw this patch, too, just to show us what it does and what our next level is going to be like. Oh my god, what? That island has a mouth. Whoa! Jeez, I thought I only had to deal with pirates in Wind Waker. Come on. Boom, boatyard. Oh, that sounds like... That sounds like a nice place to take a vacation. Alright, no, don't go back in. Stupid. Alright, so let's just settle on land here. And, actually, we'll settle on the ship, why not? And next time, we're gonna go ahead and take on Boom Boatyard, and hopefully the other secret level in this place, too. And then we'll have this bitch done for good. So, I hope you will join me when we do that. Thanks, everyone, for watching. This is Argon Matrix, signing out. Thank you, and good night.